Now, Congress leader Endi Tewari has accepted Rohit Shekhar as his son. This after a long legal battle by the young man involving a DNA test as well. Endi TV Siddharth speaks to Endi Tewari about the case. Uh, I'm joined now by Mr. Tiwari and uh, Rohit as well. Uh, Mr. Tiwari, if I can begin by asking you, this has been a long legal battle. Uh, Rohit has fought for that title to be addressed as your son. Are you finally now willing to accept him as your son? Of course. What has changed? I have already been so told the Oath Commissioner about this matter and I am proud of my association with this great family, which is, which is named, which is no well known throughout the country. What about Rohit, sir? Are you willing to actually just look at him right now and, and address him as your son? That's been the crux of the entire legal Well, battle. it has already been accepted by me. When uh, the case was put, uh, the DNA was, was, test was taken and it was approved that uh, he is my biological son. That's right, sir. In fact, two yes. years ago, the court said that the DNA uh, test matches him as your uh, biological son. Yes. However, but despite that, the legal battle continued in court. Uh, despite that, your lawyers kept the Whatever might have been discussed earlier, I, set, I would like to set the matter at rest today by uh, accepting that he is my biological son. What has changed, sir? Huh? What, ha what has changed for Nothing you? Nothing has changed. Menacing has changed, only that uh, I have accepted it publicly that uh, I had already done it before the Oath Commissioner. Do you say this because you are compelled now by law, because you have been fighting this, perhaps you are tired? Or do you say this now because you perhaps look back at this and say that he has been struggling, he has been trying to get accepted legally? No, no, I do not say this because I do not launch, want to launch myself in another unnecessary controversy. I admit that he is my biological son and uh, I think that puts the matter at rest. At rest. <laughs> biological son or son? Son, son is a son. son. Biological son means uh, because it happens. So, your son is so much in court, so if you are a son, then I am your son. 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 As a family, how do you how, how do you plan to take that? Would you like to spend time with Rohit? The time that you why not? Why not? Uh, I wish him all the best best luck. Ujjwalari, if I can uh, I'll turn to you, uh, yes. it, it, it's been a long battle for you as well, yes. uh, and this wasn't supposed to be a battle. I mean, this was about Rohit getting acceptance. Uh, finding out you know who his real biological father is and and hoping to address him as as that is Very does this now finally complete that actually the struggle has been merely for paternity only nothing else only to get um, to uh, acknowledge that his father should acknowledge the truth the truth that he is his son Yes, a lot of hurt and a lot of harassment. We are going to fight it out. And humiliation was caused. Um, I hope that that these these deep wounds that that has that uh, that have been, you know, the scars that she she has been, you know, she has gone through the pain that she has gone through for thirty five years, and I have gone through. I don't want anyone else to go through that, and I hope, I hope and pray. That is, it, it sets a good precedent before everyone mm -hmm. that this is not done in our society. He, he has done it, he has done his job. I hope with his behavior, he will heal the wounds. The wounds are going to be, it is not going to go away right now, even if I pretend to. All I want now at this point is to spend some time with him because what he has done, he is our case has set an example, has set a precedent for the court and I hope for the best for many other litigants who are suffering. I know how, what suffering, you know, when, how clogged our courts are, how clogged our judiciary, I, I felt the pain.